This is an excerpt of a recent Power Up webinar called Ask Larry Anything. Hi, my name is Larry Jordan. In this excerpt, I'll show you how to move a stack of titles in Final Cut Pro 10. Let's shift into editing. And Bill asks, I have a background generator on the timeline. He's inside Final Cut, by the way, with four connected clips above it, each of which has cross dissolves at both ends. So they're each a connected storyline. When I drag the three clips, the connected storylines jump back to their original locations. However, if I drag each of these three connected storylines one at a time, each moves to the new end of the timeline and stays there. Why? And the answer is, <laughs> you're dragging in the wrong place. Let me illustrate. Here I have a background clip, and I've got several text files above it. These text files don't have any dissolves in it. If I grab one, I can drag it wherever I want. I have them aligned at the end of the, the clip, but the alignment really does not make any difference at all. I can select all of these and move them all as a group. I'm going to type Command T and add dissolves. And now, because of the way that Final Cut works, it converts these clips into connected storylines. See this bar across the top because there's a transition at the beginning and the end. If I grab these clips and drag it, they snap back. They're not moving. How come? Because I've selected the clip. I haven't selected the connected storyline. So let's select the bar above. Notice that now this yellow square does not just simply encompass the clip. It encompasses the clip and the transitions and the connected storyline. And when I drag it, it changes position. I'm going to grab and select all these clips. And notice that when I do, it did not select the connected storyline. It selected the clips. So again, I'm going to select here, hold the Command key down, Command click on the bar above the clips. And when I drag it, it works. If you select the clips by dragging a rectangle, I select the contents of the storyline. I don't select the storyline. These become undraggable. If I click on the bar above the clip, so I select the, the storyline, not just the clips inside it, and I got to drag by clicking on the bar. Now I can drag and the position changes. This has been an excerpt from a recent Power Up webinar called Ask Larry Anything. For the complete version of this online training, please visit our store at larryjordan.com slash store and look for Webinar 259. By the way, membership is a great value when you need to stretch your training dollars. Membership in our video training library saves you money and time. You can access all of our videos for a low monthly price of only $19.99. That's more than 1,900 movies, hundreds of hours on a wide variety of subjects. Plus, premium members can download practice media and projects. Our training covers Apple and Adobe software. We update it multiple times each month. And for more information, visit LarryJordan.com slash membership. And thanks.